Tucson, Arizona on a late Friday night dominated by an omnipresent Star Wars theme in the stands here, Utah did what it could to get on the good side of the force where it mattered most, down on the field, against Arizona's Wildcats, and, from here on out, we'll punt the geeky references to the film and its culture to a place where they belong, in a game column far, far away. Although, you gotta admit, Yoda quotes, do, or do not, there is no try and fear leads to anger, anger leads to hate, hate leads to suffering, are always a pleasure. Leave them behind, we will. A promise, that is. Okay, okay. Focus. What it all meant for the Utes was this, they had to continue the offensive firepower demonstrated against lesser foes thus far this season, and put up the kind of resistance necessary to slow athletic Arizona quarterback Brandon Dawkins. This was the league opener for both teams, a chance to establish against better competition how good or not so good they really are. Utah quarterback Tyler Huntley had proved in earlier firsts for him, his first start and his first road start, that he was a cool dude, having thrown for a billion yards and run for a bunch too. And now, in his first Pac-12 start on the road, he found a way to continue his success for the first quarter and a half, when, suddenly, he suffered his first injury. He was sacked hard and left the game with a bad shoulder. Up to that point in the game, Huntley had a quarterback rating of 217. And then, he was gone. The man Huntley had supplanted as the youth starter, Troy Williams, came off the bench to reclaim the offensive helm and find a way to help win the game, 30-24.